This video shows how to set up your Blackboard course menu. So your course menu is off here on the left hand side. It might be links like this course is or it might be buttons. So to set up what appears on your course menu, edit mode has to be on so you have to be an instructor in the course. You come over here turn edit mode on and then notice in the top right hand corner of the menu you will see the little plus. So you click that plus you have a menu of options to choose from. The ones I use most are a content area, a blank page, or a web link. Content area, that's the most prevalent one. You know, that's where you put content items, your know, items, folders, eCart resources, uh, web links. So the, the, the basic content you're sharing with your students in the Blackboard class. Having a blank page as part of your menu is useful if you, is, if you want to pull in something from the outside using an HTML embed code and have that permanently on your course menu. So if you're using an outside resource that generates an HTML code, uh, that's a, another, or another thing that's good to put on your course menu, if you're using Google Classroom, you can embed your Google Classroom calendar and have a button for that on your course menu. I've got a separate video that shows you how to do that if you want to check that out. And the third is a web link. So have a permanent URL web link on your course menu that's always there. Um, so say you are using Google Classroom, you might want to put a web link to that Google Classroom. So I'll demo that one. So edit mode's on, I come up and click the plus. I'll select web link. I'll name it our Google Classroom. And then it asks me for the URL. So I would go over to my Google Classroom, which I have open, copy the link, come here, paste the URL in, make it available, and then submit. And so then there's a link in my Blackboard course that launches my Google Classroom. So remember that link will only work for students. They click the link if they're not logged on to fcpsschools.net, they'll be prompted. So parent that link, that Google, our Google Classroom link would not work for parents. But for my parents, I would probably add a blank page. Google, name it Google Classroom Calendar. So the link is named Google Classroom Calendar, and then I would go over to my Google Classroom Calendar, grab the HTML, HTML embed code, come here, paste that in, and you can see my other video for how to do that. Uh, some other things available you can put on your course menu are dividers, kind of like horizontal lines, or one more thing to point out, tool link, that's if you want to link to a specific Blackboard tool, like a, like announcements or a link to, that shows all your discussion boards, you can add that on your course menu by at using an add tool link.